shit, it's bright. Uh, welcome to my backyard. This is my um, my workstation, where I get all the good stuff done. Just out here, soaking up the rays, making it happen. Probably thinking, what the heck is this YouTube video about? This this dude just sitting here, just talking to me like he knows me. I don't know. I'm just gonna try um do a thing where I just sit here and talk about stuff and and eat stuff and d uh, discuss stuff and. Uh, uh, so forget about forget about that. Pretend you know me. Pretend I went to school with you and you know me like I'm like I'm your third best friend. And I'll just we'll just have a chat, but you won't talk back to me because it's impossible. So as you do, I was just having a scroll through Facebook, wasting my life. Um, and I came across this video. Of this guy, some gangster dude in like a robe and like a big fat gold watch. You've probably seen it. And he cooks chicken in in Hennessy. I think I say say it. And in a deep fryer. But there's no oil, it's it's just Hennessy. Like just Yeah. Looks like the Hennessy's nice and ready. And I was watching that and I was like, what the heck? I don't know how that would taste. Would you actually be able to taste a chicken? How would you know it's cooked? Would it be crispy? Would it be soggy? It'd probably be soggy. You probably wouldn't be able to drive after you eat it. Oh, would it cook all the alcohol out of it? I've got had so many questions. This got me thinking about weird foods that are gross or not so gross but like different people like it but different people don't. So I thought I'm going to try some foods that I don't know. So I went to my local um, uh, Asian grocer and I um, bought a few things that I don't really have any idea what it is. One of them might be washing detergent pods. Uh, so I'm going to eat them and see what you reckon. This one like it looks like pudding. Like it looks like it should taste good but I can't read any of this so it could be like mushed up. Uh, salmon and mushed up caviar, which I hope it isn't. This is the one that I'm like, it looks like it could be washing detergent tablets. Just says anytime, that's the only English on there I can read. There's some mint leaves, which is why I gave me a bit of hope it could be mints. I don't know, it just looks like it's for washing. This one I just knew would taste good. It's called freaking Yam Yam. And look at this little dude. Like, it has to taste good. So the guy that sold me this didn't really have much to say about it. Just sort of looked at me and said g'day and told me these tasted good, which I didn't believe, and then gave him some money. That's about it. Just a little cheeky look in there. You can what you, you can see what you're gonna eat. They do not look like that. Oh, they smell disgusting as well. It's like um, jelly, but it's not. It feels and it smells like Play-Doh. Oh. <laughs> Tastes a bit like Play-Doh too. It's just like, literally like Play-Doh and sugar mixed together. Ugh. That is gross. This guy told me that it would taste good. It looks like Play-Doh, it tastes like Play-Doh. Maybe if you can translate this, this means Play-Doh. Are you supposed to cook it? Oh shit, maybe you're supposed to cook it. I can't read any of that shit. So, uh, maybe, <sighs> all right, we'll get back to that one. If you're supposed to cook it, I'll cook it and I'll see what I think after I Google Translate all that. But um, for now, it's a no from me. Oh, it actually smells like freaking washing detergent. All right, cool. To me, that means it's not washing detergent. I don't know where this is from. Japan, China, Korea. Um, but yeah, that, that looks like a mint. So I think we're in the clear. Not gonna be eating any bloody Tide pods today. What the frick, it's like clear. Once again, looks nothing like the packet. Yeah, I mean, it's mint. I'm glad it's mint, it doesn't taste like, I don't know what washing detergent tastes like, but it tastes like mint. That's a good start. These ones actually, it tastes like sort of all right. It's no extra, but it's any time. So you can have it any time you want. In the morning, in the afternoon, on the weekend, in the middle of the day, 10 past four in, in the afternoon, quarter past seven in the morning, 8.45 p.m., 1 a.m. You, you, you can have it any time and you can take it anywhere. It's anywhere, anytime, these are. It's good, but it's not, it's not good enough that I like want to keep it in my mouth. Oh yeah. 10 out of 10 recommend. Yan Yan, man. Look at this dude. You say no that? It's magical. 
probably not good for you. There's something about just pulling the stick, dipping the stick and eating the stick. Just like, brings him back. Don't know where it brings him back to. That's probably about all I got. That's all the food I got. That's all the things I got to talk about. That's all the food I got. So, uh, see you next week, maybe. Let me just check I'm recording. Oh yeah, we are.